assalamu alaikum welcome to nur's garden kitchen how is everybody doing today today i'm going to be making very healthy very light very nutritious full of protein dish is uh, uh, black chana black chickpeas i soak them in the water for 3 4 hours uh, or you can soak them overnight and the, when uh, when you soak them they looks like this and uh, uh, after you soak them, they become like almost double the size. I took one cup of them. So there's so many of them. Oh, look at that. They come into the different colors. They come white and there's some some of them come green like this. And, uh, and the black chana. So I took this and I soaked them last night. So there's going to be uh, become like almost a double the size. Did you see the size between this one and this one? See how small they were and they got big. So they're soaked. Even if you put it uh, for three days, change your water and keep on putting it back, uh, adding fresh water and it will sprout. This is sprout also more nutritious than this. Okay. And we are going to be using some peanuts with that. I have one cup of chickpeas, black chickpeas, black kalachana, and then I have a uh, half a cup of peanuts. Okay. And I'm gonna show you rest of the spices in a little bit later on. So let's go first boil this and uh, in the pressure cooker for at least uh, five minutes after the whistle comes. I don't count the whistles, I just put it like that. <laughs> a lot of people say this many whistles, this many. I don't really sit down over there and count the whistles. So I just uh, wanted to put this one, okay? Let's go first boil this and come back and uh, let me show you other spices after that, okay? Okay, while our uh, chana is boiling, chickpeas are boiling, uh, let me show you all the other ingredients, what we need to make this dish. Uh, we have uh, some peanuts. I took half a cup of peanuts. I have one cup of chana. It depend on you, how much you want to put it. I like a lot of peanuts, so I'm putting a lot of peanuts. Then you say you need maybe half a spoon of mustard seeds. So, and for the torka, and you need some uh, few red pepper, dried red pepper, and few curry leaves. I dry, uh, I wash them and I, uh, dry them. Uh, then also uh, we need some dry spices. Not too much spices goes in this dish. There's a salt and some cumin powder, a little bit of pepper if it's, it's optional. If you want to put it, otherwise you don't have to. And turmeric. I like turmeric because turmeric gives a lot of um, uh, health benefits. It's had an uh, anti-inflammation. So I get always my knees hurting and my, I get back pain and knee pain. So I put it in every dish. If you don't want, you don't have to put it, but it's good for you to eat this turmeric, okay? Okay, let's go see. I think our chana is ready. Our uh, chickpeas are ready. So we're gonna strain those and uh, start making tarka. That's all we have to do it. Okay, let's go see. Next step. Okay, we're gonna go to the next step. Okay, friends. Look, um, you don't want very very soft. So they're very nicely done. It's like that. See, when you press it, it's gonna be like that. You can make what the chana jor garam with that. <laughs> okay. Let's remove all this from the water and we're going to go to the next step. Okay friends, I was preheating our pan. It's hot now. We're going to put a little bit of oil, not too much oil, just a little bit of oil. We'll wait for the oil to get hot. Remember, we are making a healthy dish, so you don't want to add too much oil. I've seen some recipes, people put like cups of a cups of oil, man. I don't know how they do it, why they do it, I'm not sure. Oof. This gives me the anxiety when I see too much oil in the food. You don't have to put too much oil to make your dish healthy and tasty. Okay, friends. Our pan is hot 
and I put some oil in there, two spoons, and you're gonna put some mustard seeds, just a little bit, not too many, and be careful when you put the mustard seeds, they start popping up. Chitakte, with chitakte, bhakte rete. You have to cover them. And I'm gonna put this pepper and uh, curry leaves. Wait until the mustard seeds stop splashing, cracking. They have to crack. Okay, they're done now. We're gonna put the spinners. We're gonna fry the spinners for a little while. A few minutes. Okay friends, I've been frying peanuts for two minutes. They change the color, they're done. So we're gonna add all the spices. Turmeric, half a spoon, half a spoon of red pepper, some salt to taste, and some cumin powder. Cumin powder is also half a spoon. All these things goes in there. Fry them just for two minutes. Don't let your spices burn. Okay. Bismillah Rahmani Rahim. We're gonna put this chane. That's it. That's so simple. Okay, let me serve in the dish and show it to you, okay? Okay friends, if you like my videos, please click like and uh, write some comments. So it will really make me happy to read your comments and to know what you like and what your dislikes are. So <clears throat> please write me a comment and also uh, if you are visiting my channel for first time, please subscribe and also press that little bell icon so whenever I upload a new video you're gonna get the notification. Okay? See you next video. Bye. Allah Hafiz. Please take care. Please keep on keep us in your praise and do ask me Yadrakna. Khuda Hafiz. Allah Hafiz.